from the depth instant tutorial ladies and gentlemen today we are going to look on how to look at your blueprint and constructibles how to back them up and how to take them and send them to a friend or something so basically hold your windows key and click e as in eric and here you see you know that's the just explorer go into documents inside documents you will have the from the depth folder get into the from the depth folder inside here you have player profiles and here you should see the username you usually use if you only have one just click that and inside there we have my constructibles and such stuff like that we also have screenshots if you didn't know where they are here they are in any case uh, the constructibles are your normal blueprints and if you need to uh, restore a backup for example uh, what you basically do so um, let's say for example that um, you know the boat blueprint doesn't exist uh, and I only have the backup file I just remove the backup part and then I'll just uh, you know overwrite the other file and then I'll get back it or if there is another file of course it's saved but if you want to overwrite it because the newest version is you know scuffed and you want to restore it to an older version you'll just do that and if there is only the backup file then you only remove the backup part and your blueprint will be restored very nice now i have that same you know file that's named that so whatever but anyways, if you want to mass delete some stuff, for example, you can do it from here very easily. Now, um, I want to undo that <laughs> because I didn't want to remove them. And that's Ctrl Z if, you didn't, if you're not very handy with computers. In any case, uh, that's basically how to reach your blueprint files. And um, if you go back a step, you can go to sub objects. And that is inside here, sub objects version 2. So here you should see your turrets. If you're, you have really old stuff, they might be in here, but it's version 2. And here, if you want to send a turret to someone, um, take it from here and send it. But uh, if you send a turret and you don't really know what they are, because they're called dot blueprint as well. Uh, so you probably need to tell them that this is a turret so that they can put it in their sub objects, uh, you know, uh, folder. So basically, uh, when we want to send a blueprint to someone, what I basically do, or what I ask for when we have the tournaments, so for some privacy reason, I won't show you uh, the names, but this is Discord. This is Discord here. So what I basically do is ask you to send uh, a blueprint, and then you take the one that's not the backup, the latest saved, you can see here too, on date modified, if you select uh, view and details, you get here, uh, and you just drag it down, drop it into discord and send it uh, now this user doesn't exist so i can send it but uh, you just drop it in discord and send it and that's how you send in blueprints for our tournaments and stuff in any case uh, inside of the sub constructs uh, version 2 of course um, like i need to update a lot of my turrets so i can basically delete stuff from here so if you want to delete and not have to click a lot of times you can just uh, delete stuff here, just, you know, here you can see, golem, delete that, delete a little bit there, I can probably delete that one too, you know, just like that, very handy. And of course, you can also restore uh, backups if you have kind of saved over a good version of the turret, and then you also have a backup there. If you want to edit prefabs or send prefabs to someone else, it's not the prefabs because this is kind of old stuff. So go to pre prefabs version 2 and inside of here you find all of your um, usable, you know, prefabs. So you can send them here and um, basically send them to another friend or whatever here. You can see APS blueprint backup, that's some scrap. Of course it's just the back up file so it doesn't matter but that's how you do it so here you can reach them and if you want to make a backup you kind of hold control just just con just mark constructibles prepare version 2 sub objects version 2 and then you just click copy and then you go to you can make a new folder maybe not inside of here uh, you can move it to where you have your backup stuff but 
here we have uh, everything backed up. Very nice. So, in any case, there you can see, I can just undo that because I back them up some other way. And you might wonder, why is there a weird symbol here? And that is because I sometimes play from the depth from my computer, so my constructibles are actually automatically synced from this computer to my laptop via my phone. Isn't that crazy? If you also want to sync your constructibles between different computers, um, or even different accounts, if you and your friend want to share the same constructible folder, you can set up the syncing too. It works fantastically. Uh, you can actually do that. You can sync your constructibles. You and a friend, you can have the same constructibles folder. It will be synced. So make sure that you probably have your own folders in here and you can just share everything. Works fine. I got another tutorial for that if you want to check it out. But this is how to access, send, um, backup, and uh, do, uh, you know, restore <laughs> scuffed versions of constructibles, sub-objects, and prefabs. Bonus tip, go to your constructibles folder and then you go into the From the Depth official Discord. Uh, amazing, you have to leave the gym of this Discord and go to the From the Depth Discord. And down here you see something called Blueprint Bot. And inside here, you can go to your constructibles and you can take one of your um, blueprints, like my pod racer. You just dump it here. And by the way, another people can they can download your uh, stuff from here. So uh, you know, if you want to be very private about them, remove them fast after you posted them. Any case, um, if you also want an animated GIF of this thing. Then you can also do like this, so basically if I'll take, uh, let's take an, a finished ship. So this one for example, and then we'll just type in GIF. And then we let it be here, and here you can see we get it in its uh, colors. And it even has animations for the guns and stuff like that. And if we don't do the GIF option, if we just post it like this, uh, then we'll just get a like non-GIF version. That's basically just uh, the layout of the craft. Very nice. So that's basically how to do it. Uh, if you want to have this nice little stuff, so we can just open original, and then you can kind of save the image and stuff like that. Very handy. So, hope this little tutorial was useful for you in From Depth, and if it was, I guess I'll see you in future videos. This is Jimonism, and this has been From the Depth Instant Tutorials. We're signing out.